morning guys welcome back to my channel i am headed to equinox it's friday morning and i'm gonna bring you guys along with me for the weekend i don't have a camera mount so i don't know how long this is gonna last but i wanted to talk to you guys throughout my drive if y'all see me eating my banana mind your business i'm just kidding and i have my water but i'm going to a pilates class at 12 it's 11 p.m that just scared me. I thought it said I was, it was 11.53. Since I'm arriving at 11.53. It's 11.34. I'm gonna do a 15 minute workout and then I'm going to, I'm either gonna shower there or I'm gonna come back home and shower. I'm gonna go to my dad's house and shower because I have to go there and pick up a few packages to prepare for my Paris trip because I don't know, I don't think y'all know yet, but I'm going to Paris again. February and it's February so I'm going like in two weeks so I'm going there to pick up um, I don't want to give away too much okay I'm gonna just tell you I'm gonna just tell you so I'm going to the Mariah the Scientist concert in Paris and y'all know Mariah the Scientist like her color is red for her tour and so me and my friends were like me and my friend and my sister were like let's wear red for the concert and it's also on Valentine's Day so I ordered a red dress, but I have not seen it. It's been at my dad's house for like two weeks now. I don't know what shade of red it is. And I need a pair of shoes that go with this red color. So my camera is going every which way. So I'm gonna wrap this up. But yeah, I'm about to head to my workout. Hopefully it's a great workout. I'll bring my phone in. Again, I'm not bringing my camera in because y'all know like the discourse on bringing your recording device into a gym some people don't like that so i try to just get myself um so if i can get some footage for y'all on my phone i will but yeah let's another weekend with me this isn't like the whole week just the weekend but i hope y'all enjoy see y'all soon made it to equinox such a beautiful day i'm so excited for my workout today so let's go do some pilates Smoking scattered, this shit's on the hit like it's cracking it. The boy got rocking, sleeping, talk like a crack at it. Two S just for the TikTok, niggas put that in. Back at it. Mess the boy up and I give him the drip that I'm gonna. If this is the things that I get, nigga, you tell me who on. Then I go now, I can't pull on. No matter space in the whole zone. In the space, shit, let it fall on. Can't stop me now, nigga, hold on. I just finished that class and it was hard today like the body is so weird because this class is called Pilates Rise and it's considered to be a more athletic Pilates and so the very first class I took of this I was just like nope won't be returning can't do it but somehow some way this class like matches up with my schedule I don't really have a schedule like I'm not working right now, but it's somehow like, it's just the easiest class for me to get to. Sometimes when I take this class, I think I've taken it like eight times now. Sometimes when I take it, I'm like, wow, like I'm really, I'm feeling really strong today. I feel great. Like my body feels like I can get through it. And then some days I'm like, what the hell? Like I can't do this. Like it's just too much, but I still got through it. I still got a really good sweat in but my hair isn't like sweated out. Thank the Lord. So right now, y'all, I have like a whole schedule. Like 
something that I do um, I started like using my notes app I said I wanted to shower and shave at Equinox but I forgot my shower shoes and I'm not doing that some people in there be doing that not sorry but yeah, I'm about to I need to go to Ulta to go pick up another elf blush I'll probably grab me some chick-fil-a and chill in the car for a little bit it's just like my me time then I need to go to my dad's and pick up my packages so I'll meet y'all probably in Ulta just browsing around there and then I'll show y'all me opening my packages so yeah morning is starting off strong I'll be back before I head to Ulta I need to post my TikTok so if y'all haven't already follow me on TikTok I have way more subscribers on YouTube than TikTok so run it up all right guys we're walking into Ulta now what I came in here for is seven dollars but let's pray I don't spend more than 50 I'm giving myself 50 dollar budget and of course I see a sign that says buy one get one NYX 40% off and that's where I love to get my lipsticks from all right let's see All right, just a super quick haul. Um, I am going to the mall later, so don't judge me, but I need to buy some red shoes. I already told y'all. But um, I just went to go get this re-up on this e.l.f. camo blush. This is the bronze bombshell. I talk about this a lot on my TikTok, but it's just this pretty like orangey brown shade, and I think it looks really good on um, tan skin tones. And then I got this um, Ordinary Acne Set. I use this moisturizer and I'm out of it and I needed some new ones, but I also needed a new face wash. And I've been using the Fenty face wash for years now and I really wanna switch it up. Um, and so this set has the cleanser, the salicyl, salicyl, oh my God. Salicylic acid and then the moisturizer so I'm gonna try this set out um, please 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 drop your skincare recommendations I have normal to dry skin I usually only get acne when um, I'm on my cycle or about to start my cycle so that's not really an issue but I do get like dryness um, yeah I just want to keep a clear complexion like when I work out a lot sometimes I get oily um, so then I get blackheads and stuff like that so just anything to keep my pores clean and my skin nice and healthy and moisturized. Please let me know what to buy because I want to try something new. All right, I'm headed over to Chick-fil-A. And I know this was the same as a routine in my last vlog, but I can't help myself. That's where I'm headed. All right guys, I completely flopped last night on vlogging my food. Today is Saturday, February 3rd, and we're going to have a sister date, and we're gonna go to the creative art studio. We're gonna paint ceramic objects, whatever we choose. So first things first, we're going to get breakfast. Do they have hot chocolate there? No. <sighs> we're going to get breakfast. All right, let's go. Okay, first stop of the day was New York Bagel. We have been coming here for our entire lives and we get the egg bagels. They have the best homemade cream cheese. Well, I feel like everywhere has homemade cream cheese. They don't? Uh, well, they have schmear. It's like this same type of texture. But I'm like, it's not like, I'm saying it's not like Philadelphia cream cheese. I got a Pepsi. Did you just show your Pepsi like that? Yes. 
Camille got her bagel like pre-made, but I just feel like they put way too much cream cheese. Like I just can't. And I don't eat my bagels as a sandwich. Comment down below, if you grew up eating bagels, I feel like all Midwestern people and East Coast people grew up eating bagels. But I don't eat my bagel like a sandwich. I eat one side, then one side. Is that weird that I do that? You Same told, with Oreos. You like, told them to comment down below, but you didn't tell them what to comment. Oh, comment down below like how you eat your bagels. Do you eat them as a sandwich or do you eat one side and the other side? Yeah. Like walking into a bagel, are they called bagel shops? Walking into a bagel shop is so nostalgic for me. Like I spent years, like over five years without walking into a bagel place. So when I first came into New York Bagel, like since moving back home, I was just like, oh my God. Yeah, cause you this never smells like my childhood. Get this cream cheese. Mm. I don't think there are any like. This bagel is phenomenal. But I'm not gonna let y'all watch me smacking the whole time. So we're gonna eat our bagel. And we'll catch y'all at the Creative Arts Studio. I just heard somebody say that they were had 10 groups waiting. What? Happy birthday. Hey, <laughs> 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 Gotta figure out what the next process is. Gotta pick out our stuff and grab our colors. <laughs> All right guys, so we made our selections. I chose this mug and saucer plate. And then I'm gonna do like a bunch of different variations of pink and red. Like I really wanna go for like the, this kind of design. So hopefully I learn, I know how to do some hearts today. Time to get started. I think I'm gonna start with the plate first because I care less about the plate. So if I mess up, then it is what it is. started with <laughs> just some small pink hearts and Camille. I'm just painting flowers. Why well, such a cute flower? And I'm gonna switch it up for the mud. I'm gonna do like a checkered print mug. So and then I'll probably do like these hearts on the inside after I do the checkered print. So let's see how this goes. Like the first 
15 minutes I was super relaxed like almost fell asleep in there you got stressed but then like yeah certain times sometimes I like overthink activities like this and then I'm like I don't like this I'm like I was going and it stresses me out but like activities like this are supposed to relax you that was a great activity tomorrow we're going to a play I was gonna end the vlog today but we're continuing with this artsy theme it's a month of art I didn't vlog when we went to Harry Potter but I'll insert some clips here But yeah, it's already February 3rd, and like we've done two art type activities. And, and we've gone to the movies. And we've gone to the movies, and then tomorrow we're going to a play at the Detroit Public Theater, and then on the 8th, I believe. Is it the 8th? Yeah, Tuesday. And then on the 8th, we're going to see um, Wicked. So, and then on the 13th we're going to Paris so <laughs> February Black History Month my birthday month her birthday month is, is lit so yeah hopefully we find some food soon but I'll catch y'all when I catch y'all good morning guys please don't mind the planet on my face but I'm doing some skincare we're about to get ready to go to a play as I said yesterday I didn't come back all we did was we went to go get some dinner and then we sat and watched a movie. But I have my clothing rack that I set up with all my like newer pieces. If you want to go see these pieces up and close, I've made a TikTok. I like some of my new stuff. This red dress was a feature, but this is what I'm wearing on Valentine's Day. And then this is what I'm wearing to the club in Paris. I don't even know why I'm talking about this. But um I was like, let me pick up the camera and show them me getting ready for this play. So yeah, I'm gonna pick out an outfit for today. We're going to see a play at the Detroit Public Theater. Because I have this on my face, I don't know what I'm gonna do with my makeup yet, but as far as outfit, I think I wanna do this sweater. I have this thick sweater from Zara. I got it for like $20 during their sale. And I'm wearing my like long brown coat. I'm wearing this coat from Aritzia. So we have like a taupey green shade and a brown shade. So I think I'm gonna like stay in that family. I'm gonna try out these cargo pants, these green cargo pants. So. Mm. I wish I had some pants slightly darker. I'm gonna try it. Um, I'm gonna try these two together and see how I like it. I'll come and show y'all like how the outfit looks and then I'll add the finishing touches with my hair and makeup. But yeah, I'm so excited that like we're doing more artsy type activities. I just feel like it just like fuels me in a way that, you know, going to a club or going to get brunch doesn't. It's like, I don't know, like, Every time you leave an artistic activity, you feel inspired. And that might sound corny, but like, I really believe that. So, yeah, let me put on my clothes one sec. All right, change of plans. I decided to go with this white short sleeve shirt, and it is like a crop top. Hold on. I don't think y'all can see. It is a crop top, and I'm wearing them with the same cargo pants. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it on with this coat and I'm gonna zip the bottom so like the crop part doesn't show but yeah I just um sometimes I'll do baggy on baggy things when I'm like 
going shopping or just like chilling but I do like something that like hugs my figure more so than that sweater did if I'm gonna be wearing like also like baggy-ish pants so I know y'all can't see the full look but right now I'm gonna sit and do my hair and makeup so let's go over there to my little station and I'm gonna use Val Valentino I don't even know what this is called I think it's Voice Viva My glasses cover up the little bump that I have. And yeah, a lot of times when I wear my glasses, it messes up my makeup anyway because it's just resting on my face for so long. And I need my glasses to see this place. So, fresh face today. This is the look. Let's go to the play. is we're going to see Wicked tonight and I'm so excited because I saw this musical maybe 10 years ago and it was, wait, do I have my glasses? Okay, I have my glasses. I saw this musical 10 years ago and it was amazing. But when I went to go see it, I was all the way in the back and I didn't have my glasses on. So it was like, I was just listening to it. I really didn't see like the characters' faces or anything. And so when we found out they were coming to Detroit again, all the way in 2024 they've probably been here multiple times since then but i haven't been home i was just just did not want to pass it up so i'm with my mom she's driving and we're about to go get my sister are we are we going to get camille or yes we are oh my god we're gonna be so late yeah we're about to go get my sister and then we're gonna go to dinner and then the show starts at 7 30 it's 5 35 right now so hopefully dinner is fast but yeah I'm super excited. I'm gonna bring you guys throughout the night us going to dinner and then us arriving to the, the Detroit Opera House. But yeah, this weekly vlog has been full of like artistic type activities and I really enjoyed it. So hopefully I can keep it up. But yeah, I hope you guys have been enjoying the vlog so far and if you wanna see more, then keep on watching. dinner but that is fun. we're off to see Wicked! So exciting! Thank you. 